Chicago is a massive city, and it's made up of 77 different neighborhoods. But recently, one of those neighborhoods ranked among the top 10 most popular in the country, and that neighborhood is Lakeview, which is located along Lake Michigan, just a few miles north of downtown. Now, I live in Lakeview, and I will admit I absolutely love living here. However, like most neighborhoods, it's not for everybody. So in this video, we're gonna go over the pros and the cons of living in Chicago's most popular neighborhood. My name is Peter and I'm a realtor here in the Chicagoland area. If you're thinking about moving to Chicago and would like some assistance, feel free to touch base. All of my contact info is down below. I'd love to have a conversation with you and I'm sure that my team can help you out. All right, let's get started with the pros. And pro number one about living in Lakeview is its proximity to Lincoln Park and Lake Michigan. As the name suggests, not only will you get fantastic views of the lake here in this neighborhood, but you'll also be able to take advantage of everything that it and the park have to offer. For starters, you'll have access to a scenic nine-hole golf course, miles of biking, walking, and running trails, softball fields, tennis courts, beaches, and tons of green space for outdoor activities. And overall, it's just very beautiful. You'll have great views of all the high-rises along Lakeshore Drive. You'll be able to see downtown Chicago and also admire the harbors along the lake. Now, of course, it's most enjoyable in the summer when there's a ton going on and you'll be able to enjoy a little bit of that lake breeze during those hot days. Clearly, I'm a massive fan of the lake and truthfully, I couldn't imagine myself living a whole lot further from it than I already do. Fortunately, nearly anywhere you live within Lakeview, the lake and park will only be a short walk away. Pro number two about living in Lakeview is being close to Wrigley Field. Wrigley Field is home to the Chicago Cubs and it's also one of the oldest baseball stadiums in the country. Now, the best part about Wrigley is that it's seamlessly integrated with the rest of the neighborhood. With most stadiums, you'll have a ton of parking lots that surround them, but here, instead of parking lots, you have apartment buildings, restaurants, bars, shops, and it honestly feels like you just took a baseball stadium and plopped it right in the middle of a neighborhood. It makes going to baseball games an absolute blast because there's so much to do both before and after the game. Additionally, there's been a lot of investment into Wrigleyville over the last few years, and there's a ton of community events that occur now, such as movie nights, yoga classes, small concerts, as well as beer tastings. And in the winter, Wrigleyville becomes a Christmas market. It's the second location here in Chicago, and it's an awesome one. You have a lot of local shops outside of the stadium, and then inside you have access to an ice skating ring and many other activities for the winter. Finally, there's a ton of concerts that go on here in Wrigleyville. Top name artists that when they come to Chicago, this is where they perform because this is their stop. So having access to all of that within just a short walk away is a huge plus to living in Lakeview. Pro number three about living in Lakeview is its walkability. It's one of the most walkable neighborhoods in the city, and you're never more than 15 minutes away from things like restaurants, grocery stores, pharmacies, bars, doctors, dentists, and even public transportation. And speaking of public transportation, that's a huge plus here in Lakeview because you have several bus stops and train stops that can easily get you downtown or to other neighborhoods in the city. Lakeview is also very bikeable. Not only do you have access to the lakefront trails that I mentioned earlier, but most of the streets here have dedicated bike lanes. So if biking is your preferred method of transportation, then Lakeview will be the perfect place. So it goes without saying that you do not need a car to live comfortably in Lakeview. In fact, most people ditch it entirely and just walk, bike, and take public transit to get anywhere else in the city. Pro number four about living in Lakeview is that it really has something to offer for just about anyone. I like to break the neighborhood up into three different sections. There's East Lakeview, Central Lakeview, and West Lakeview. East Lakeview is closer to the lake and park, and it's also home to one of the largest LGBTQ communities in the country. Here you'll find a lot of clubs, restaurants, and comedy venues, and a lot of your housing options here will either be high-rises along the lake or walk-up buildings. Central Lakeview is home to Wrigleyville, which, as I mentioned, is a very lively place. The housing options here will be mostly walk-up buildings and boutique four to six unit buildings. Now, West Lakeview is a little bit more slower paced and more family oriented. Here you'll find the Southport Corridor, which is a higher end street filled with luxury stores and restaurants. And the housing options here will typically be high end single family homes. So with those three different sections, as well as many other smaller sub neighborhoods, I'm confident that nearly everybody 
will find the right fit for them. Okay, and rounding out the pros at number five is going to be the food selection here in Lakeview. Whether you're looking for Italian food, Mexican food, Japanese food, or even some basic American grub, you're gonna have a lot of options here. The food scene in Lakeview is very diverse. Not only that, but you also have a lot of new restaurants that seem to be popping up all over the place, trying new foods and combining other foods to make for great experiences. So if you're a big foodie and you don't like dining at the same places over and over again, like trying new things, you're gonna have a lot of options here in Lakeview. Just be careful, it is all too easy to spend too much money on food here. Okay, so that covers most of the highlights about living in Lakeview. Now, it's not perfect, there are some cons to it. Let's jump into those. Con number one is gonna be the higher cost of living. Given all the pros that we just talked about and that Lakeview now ranks as one of the most popular neighborhoods in the country, is no surprise that living here is a lot more expensive than it would be elsewhere. In fact, the cost of living in Lakeview is about 35% higher than the rest of Illinois and 32% higher than the rest of the country. And the biggest reason for that is the higher cost of housing. Here, the median sales price is about $485,000, which is well above the $350,000 median for Chicago as a whole. Rental prices have also jumped here, with the median rent for a one bedroom coming in at $1,895, and for a two bedroom, $2,648. There are other costs that are also elevated here in Lakeview, such as the cost of transportation, which is about 15% higher than the national average, and the cost of groceries, which is about 10% higher. Of course, everyone has a different lifestyle and spending habits, but generally speaking, if you wanna live comfortably in Lakeview, it will likely take a higher salary or some roommates. Con number two about living in Lakeview is all of the noise. Now, it should come as no surprise that when you plop a baseball stadium right in the middle of a neighborhood, you're gonna get a lot of the noise pollution that comes with it. And while I enjoy the sounds of a cheering crowd during a baseball game when I open my windows, I realize it might not be for everyone. Even outside of Wrigleyville, other parts of Lakeview do have a lot of clubs and bars, so they draw large crowds, especially during the weekends, and things could get a little bit noisy. Also, because the neighborhood is still very much so growing in population, you got a lot of construction being done on buildings and roads. Construction is noisy, and it creates for some traffic, which leads to honking, etc. More, more noise, essentially. Overall, if you're looking for a more peaceful neighborhood, you might be able to find some of that in West Lakeview, but overall, in general, it'll be pretty hard to find here. Con number three about living in Lakeview is all of the traffic. Now, I mentioned it's a very very walkable neighborhood and I highly encourage people to just ditch their cars entirely because owning a car here can sometimes be a nightmare. Because of all the amenities that it has to offer, there are always people looking to move from one point to another within the neighborhood. And as a result, you get a lot of cars on the road and it sometimes takes a very long time just to drive a couple blocks. Also, with the high traffic comes a lot of difficulties in finding parking. Unless you have a dedicated spot or a garage, you probably will find yourself circling around neighborhoods just trying to find a spot and sometimes on really bad days, especially when the weather is severe, that can take upwards of 30 minutes. It's not enjoyable, and the parking situation here probably isn't gonna get any better anytime soon. So if you do own a car in Lakeview, just be prepared for all the traffic, and I highly recommend, if you can, rent out a garage or a private spot. But in a perfect world, just ditch the car entirely, walk, and take public transportation everywhere you need to go. So I wanted to have two more cons wrap up the rest of this video. However, I had a tough time thinking of what those are. The truth is that Lakeview is a fantastic neighborhood to live in. It offers so much, it has so much going on, and nearly anybody that I talk to really enjoys either coming here and definitely living here. So as a result, I'm gonna leave it at that with slightly more pros than I have cons. However, if you have your own opinion on Lakeview, I'd love to hear it in the comments down below. And if you're somebody that's looking to learn a little bit more about Chicago, feel free to stick around on this channel because I got a lot more content on the city. Thanks so much for watching and I'll catch you guys in the next video.